Tony Media. Hello everyone, it's Tony. So the guys of One Officer are back with their fifth mini album. It's still actually really perplexing to me that it's been five mini albums already. It feels just like yesterday we had Valkyrie, but yes, they are back with their fifth mini album titled Binary Code, and with it comes their music video, their title track titled Black Mirror. And this is off of the follow-up to their previous comeback, which was No Diggity. And if you haven't checked it out already, I really, really enjoyed the more mature sound that they're bringing, but like a bit of that kind of like crazy that they're adding to it like almost like that idea of like the teenaged angst concept to but to a different point really really love that because that's following off of obviously intro the devil is in the details and then obviously their previous pre comeback was Bouchard and then before that we had the road to kingdom stuff so they're kind of like I would say the road to kingdom era because I really enjoyed like what happened from say like a, a song written so easily and then them transitioning to like to uh, come back home and then to be or not to be in particular those two songs Songs, those two like just new kind of concepts that they developed from Road to Kingdom really special and I think marked a special kind of like just change in these guys in terms of both sound and then also just in terms of image and concept really enjoyed I do apologize for hitting the mic just now really really enjoyed it. and if you want to check out any of my reactions to anything uh one also related so we've started from our song really easily and we've been all the way up here but I've known about them since Valkyrie it's an awesome group and if you want to check out anything greatly appreciate it it's all in the description box below and in today's extent as well i would love to know in the comment section below who your favorite bias is who stood out to you from this music video and without further ado let's not waste any more time and let's get into black mirror let's go interesting Ooh, i like that is he saying we're in this babylon I like the ba 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 like the da da da. It feels a little bit jazzy, but definitely when you think about Black Mirror, when I saw all the teasers, like the photos at least, I wasn't thinking that they'd go in a more like retro beat. It felt like you know they were gonna go maybe a little bit more buttoned up, you know. Um, I'm interested. I'm very interested. It's not bad sounding. It's just that it's very different from specifically No Diggity. So I'm curious. I'm very curious. I like the bass. I like having his deep voice in contrast. I believe everybody said that this was their that he's their leader. He also do he does the lyrics and everything. I'm I, I really like his like kind of charisma that he brings into the music videos. Really, really a fan. Um I don't know anybody's name, I do apologize. I'm really hopefully not in the hole. <laughs> Oh, I like this pre chorus. Ooh, I'm feeling this. I'm feeling it. All right. Oh. Okay, we're gonna talk about this in a second. I just wanna fit it with the course right now. Oh, the band? Oh, I like that little detail. Like how it's sequined. Oh. Okay. Okay, so there's a lot to dissect a little bit. I really enjoyed that having like a bit more like full voice and then a little bit higher tone, a little bit more kind of like almost nasally. It adds a little cool contrast there. And the inclusion of the violin in that guy's chin is really nice. Oh, but this... Like how he... Da, 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 da. Ah, the, the rap? Oh. Well, not, sorry, not the like the rap as in like R A P, but like kind of just like how it comes in. Oh, so nice. Oh, the piano. Boom, boom. Ooh, the way they come in, Black Mirror, is so nice. I actually really like that. The like J, like the uh, Michael M J vibes a bit, especially even the suit. 
That's nice. Like the binary kind of aspect to it, and the transitions. Interesting how they have like a, almost like a cowbell. Like, you can hear it right here. And then they come back to like this retroist aspect. But then there's like this violin that I really enjoy here. I really enjoy having the violin. And this detail I think is really cool. Like they're like in one side it's very just um psychedelic in the colors, but then the lighting isn't crazy. But then here it's almost as if there's like a blurring of the actual coloring and it's not just because of the sequence. Obviously that has to do with it, but like it it's like an aspect here that they don't reflect there so there's like a differences even though this one's dark this one's bright it's kind of like the idea of just the um the binary idea that they're doing really cool. i'm really liking the violin in this section oh i like the little black mirror it's like magic Wait, they really pulled a lot of inspiration from OJ now that I think about it. This, even this outfit, because in the previous one we had, uh, what is it? Like you have, you have like that outfit, and now you have this outfit. Okay, a lot of, a lot of inspiration from OJ here. I like the transitions with the violins in particular. The strings instruments play a little big part in this, I think. Ooh, we got, I got. Oh, time with the violin there? Oh, the pre-chorus is so nice to hook into it. Oh. I don't know what it is, but I I really... Nah, nah, like how they... I think it's because it would cut. And it's like... It's the music, the instrumentation that leads into it. It's very smooth, very clean, I think. Does anybody else find that he kind of looks like Su- Like, I, when I looked at him, I was like, he looks familiar. He kind of looks like really quickly, very quickly, like TXT Subin. I think that's what it is. Or like bone structure? I don't know what it is. I like that. Oh, I like- I like how you can hear the details, like when they stomp it, like it just like how it just exactly like in MJ songs, we can hear the stomps, like, what? Ah, I love it. Do, 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 do. Oh, I love it. Oh, the little cowbell is interesting. Wow. This song grows on you, honestly. But this is like what I saw from the teaser, just, just a, as a reference. Like you see this from the ref, the teasers, and you're like, oh, okay, Black Mirror, you know, it's gonna be kind of like hard hitting. But they really went in a different direction. And I'm, honestly, at first I was like, oh, okay. But listening to it more, that hook in particular, need to the court towards the chorus, and the chorus itself, really fun and kind of like vibrant. And I do appreciate the nice instrumentation with the violins and everything. So, um. Definitely not what I was expecting, but it grows on you. It definitely grows on you. And I think it's just a bit like, especially if this came off of Bouchard, which was their pre-release comeback to uh, No Diggity, I think it would have made a lot more sense to me because No Diggity kind of falls under a little bit of a darker feel. But I understand that, you know, summertime, springtime, it makes sense for a bit of a lighter, brighter song in more of like something that you can get up and dance to. So totally makes sense to me. Just like a very kind of surprise though at like where the concept has been going back and forth because they're kind of like doing a mature thing here. But at the same time, they're going into like a fun route at the same time, like showing two different uh, aspects and they haven't done that yet. So I like that. It's pretty cool. Ooh, the old, my MJ Pample is done. The violin plays a big part in here. Oh, they're blowing a lot of piano here. Ooh. Oh, I like the effect there. The tracking. Oh, I like the rapping. Oh, I like his rapping. Oh, they kind of do something similar, just like in the beginning, how you had the full voice. Um, here. 
Black mirror. We are on this Babylon. Similar, similar, similar. But also, just also even here. Full voice. Well, we have a forward voice here, in my opinion. Higher, higher voice, a like higher tone voice with a bit of like a nasal to like have that really cool um, kind of duality. They're doing something similar here. Deep, deep. And then you have come in. See, even here, you can hear more of like a bass, whereas like if you hear listen Claire, closely. Okay, well, that's part. Like, there's a bit more of like a higher up, upbeat tone, and then when it comes in, it's just the bass now, a lot deeper. Ooh, the sparkle. Yeah. Ooh, did it? Oh, okay. There was the dip. There was the MJ. Mira. Yeah, was, uh, this is straight up MJ. Even though a high note's there. Really nice. Oh, wow. They do the, even they did this. Wow. Break it down. The tribute to MJ is real in this song. Wow. Even the pose and everything? Yo, there's. You can't say that this isn't dedicated towards the king. They. 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 They dedicated this to the king. And it, it's a really good dedication, honestly. Like, it's not like a straight up copy, but it's very much like a. Like, a showing a little Easter eggs. Well, actually, not Easter eggs. It's just kind of like at the end, just yelling it at you. But it's really cool. I really, really enjoyed it at the very end. I think that this song overall just grows on you more and more the more you listen to it. And it's definitely going to be an interesting song. I think that it's a song that it's going to be fun to dance to. It's going to be a cool little, like, upbeat song. Is it my favorite one off song? I'm not. I'm going to be very honest. Probably not. But at the same time, this is a concept. This is like an idea. This is like a sound that I haven't heard from them yet. So it'll be cool to see where they follow up from that because they are real i don't really know where they ever go i don't really know where they ever go but i like this more mature type of style they're taking it to now it's not being it's like being less of like the flower boy feel and being much more of like a mature boy uh male group vibe and i'm really liking it i'm really liking where they're going with their vibe all of a sudden um and i'm hopefully gonna check out more one us too obviously what more one us very coming very soon and uh, again let me guys know what who your bias is in the comment section below hopefully you enjoyed this video hopefully check out some more of my one us reactions down in the comments in the description box below but that being said guys thank you so much for watching i'm Salamanida, and as always if you have any comments questions or something you want to talk feel free to leave in the comment section below and i'll get to you as soon as possible with that being said guys it's been tony and goodbye and i'll see you in the next video and